survivability is a really big one. You know, we, we order our seed based on our calculations for how many plants per square foot we are targeting. On average, we're targeting about 70%, but there's a very big variety of seeding units out there. And some of them, those survivabilities are upwards towards, you know, 90, 95%. So the biggest thing is I need guys to get out there, count how many plants they have in there, and then adjust for the following years based on what the conditions are gonna be like. If we have good conditions and they're seeing 90% survivability, it's equating to, you know, over 10 plus plants per square foot. I had a guy where he had 16 plants per square foot. Now, if this drought continues and we've got 16 plants per square foot, that crop is absolutely gonna suffer just with these tall spindly plants that aren't getting enough nutrients up for them. So that's probably the number one because everybody thinks that they like to see a nice mat of canola out there but sometimes that can be more of a detriment than, you know, having less than six plants per square foot.